we once again take you behind the scenes and travel alongside the team during our recent tour to Kimberley, where we took our neighbours Greg was in the Colin Curry Cup. Spirits were high as the players arrived before departure, but it seemed that Ruan forgot something at home. Our leading try scorer on his way to Kimberley. Yeah, our manager. Okay, we go for the ship by water song. It's dry, it's dry, Kimberly. Dry, Kimberly, and hydration. Hydration is vital. H2O. Just outside Bloemfontein, we spotted a certain physiotherapist casually driving alongside the team bus. To make the two-hour odd bus ride go faster, some players would take a well-deserved nap, only to be rudely awakened by others. But uh, got that on film. Old, old hometown. Oh, you know. We back, baby. Oh, Rob. Feeling refreshed in the morning sunshine, it was time for the pre-game warm-ups outside the hotel that involved forwards and backs split into two groups. After announcing his departure from the Toyota Cheetahs at the end of the season, coach Albert Kiris could not help himself but remind Aidan Davis that his time in a Cheetah jersey was fast coming to an end even at the team breakfast. See the emotion on his face, he's playing his seventh, third or fourth last game. So emotional. Oh, AD. I fight the last, the dad, the fear, the pre match meal, the Richitas. Why are you emotional? Fight the last, the fear, the dad. Oh, Joe. So I did the camera, Joe. You are a great bus driver. Upon arrival at Tafelaga Park, the players knew they were in for a rigorous clash against a very dangerous Greek was side who aimed to stay in the hunt for a semi-final spot. <laughs> And the wind blowing towards us, so the passing will be easy. So it's easy to, to keep the ball through phases and either squad ties, get penalties, get them to their, their 22. Okay, there's going to be time when it's going to go tough. We stick together, we stay positive. All right, yep. Go stop! Yes! Go, boys! Go, boys! The last time these two sides met, the men from Bloemfontein claimed the victory in the first round of the Curry Cup, but this time around the Peacock Blues came out firing, scoring inside the first minute, and they never looked back after that, eventually ending our unbeaten run of 2022, but keeping their hopes of a playoff well and truly alive. <laughs>